Fish tank people, what is up? It's your man Shane on a Saturday night, and I am gonna do another episode of my subscriber expose. I've been slipping on that for the last couple weeks, getting ready for the move. More to come on that. But I was in chat, and there's always a constant f uh, a flow of people in chat. It seems like one of my buddies on chat is uh, my boy Tommy, and uh, Canadian guy in the ponds. Um, Planet Tanks, the whole nine yards, and his YouTube channel, I will put it in the description, is Tommy's Fish. And the one thing I like about Tommy, one, is his enthusiasm. He's really enthusiastic about about the hobby, and, and he's fairly young, and, and he's new at it. So he's not a genius by any means when it comes to ponds or Planet Tanks, etc., etc. Um, and I think that's refreshing. I, I, I think too often I look, or, or we as a group look for people that have established tanks and putting out a whole bunch of info when um, it's really nice to see somebody mature from knowing nothing and just starting a brand new tank all the way up to being amazing and having all these cool ass tanks like for me it's TSK and Mike the people that I had a hand in their tanks and that's what drives me to keep helping people online um, so f for instance this happens to be one of his videos that I absolutely love he has a pond his pump went out, he went to Lowe's, they had it on clearance, so he's letting everybody know it's on clearance, and he went and got a new pump. So he's, you know over the next few months you're going to get these cool videos about how he um, patched up his pond, or put rocks around the outside, or how he aquascaped it, and the plants he's adding. Just really cool stuff. I mean, it's cool to see nice gorgeous tanks, but it's even better to see the build up to those nice gorgeous tanks and ponds. Then on the next one, this is his planted tank. He's going to get a plant order this weekend, so I wanted to just show everybody what it looked like before. It's rocks. Rocks, a little piece of driftwood, and a couple of swords. Um, and he had just gotten a new lighting fixture, which happens to be a T5. And if uh, you want to know where to get a very, very cheap dual bulb T5, this is the guy to talk to. He'll tell you where he got his Odyssea, and they're uh, pretty solid little fixtures. And then also, he went out and kind of found his own driftwood, and he was kind of talking about it and uh, talking about some of the thoughts for his tank coming up and his plate he has a couple tanks so um, switching up how he does it but I love seeing young enthusiastic people uh, that are on the website that are on fish tank TV that are doing videos um, and and I, and I like to watch them mature as aquarium as aquarium enthusiasts so uh, do me a favor I told Tommy that by tomorrow night he'd go from 26 subs to 50 subs and he's one of those people that are really into the hobby um, and uh, really excited about talking to people on YouTube and watching your videos so uh, subscribe to him and then leave him a message or a comment for him to sub to you and I'm sure he'd be more than happy to so Tommy nice job on the videos man keep it up I'll talk to you soon later boss